everybody welcome back to my channel um if you have never been here before my name is logan and i make college lifestyle vlog videos i don't know pretty much anything that you would expect from a like lifestyle you youtuber i usually make so but if you are not subscribed be sure to do that that would be awesome and if you want to like this video do that as well i wanted to do a little update before i got into this week's video so i'm doing a vlogmas right now but i'm doing it by week because i just don't have the stamina nor the time to do it by day so <laughs> i'm doing um vlogmas by a week so i promised you guys that i would do a weekly vlogmas video as well as an extra video a week that's like more towards like the style of videos that I do on my channel. So this was the video that I had planned for Vlogmas week one. Like I was going to do Vlogmas week one and then reflecting on my semester and I was going to film it on the last day of my first semester of college and like all was well. I was going to upload it. It was going to be fine. And then, <laughs> and then Miss Swift comes in and ruins my plans once again. She ruins my life. <laughs> um, so I don't know when this video is going to go up because today is the 10th, which means tonight I am filming my reaction to Ever, is it called Evermore? <laughs> I don't remember. I'm going to be filming my Evermore reaction video tonight and that's definitely going to be going up like tomorrow or Saturday. So, um, because I have to get them up while they're trending because I don't want to put it up like a week from now. So I don't know if you guys are going to get two bonus videos this week. Like if I'm going to upload this one tomorrow and my folklore reaction tomorrow or if i'll just wait to upload this one until like the middle of next week i don't know so whenever you're seeing this video hey anyway i wanted to do a reflection on my semester in college because it was very different than how i envisioned my first semester of college to go i'm a freshman this year which means i graduated in the midst of a pandemic and i started college in the, in the midst of a pandemic so two very different things that all happened during a pandemic um and i thought that it would be helpful not only to myself but to the world and to people who may be studying college or like i don't know people who are in college and want to share experiences i thought this video would be nice so that's what i'm doing so at my school i was super lucky we were um doing hybrid courses so you could either choose to do all online or do hybrid and i chose to do hybrid because i thrive in learning environments that are in person i just don't I don't do well when I'm online um I don't I don't I don't want to say that I don't do well but I know that I'm not getting um out of it what I want and I, I should get out of it what I want when I'm paying you know heck of dollars so um I chose to do hybrid that was my personal decision so compared to some of my other friends like experiences that go to my school um a lot of them didn't have a lot of in-person classes and most of mine were in person at least once a week so i got i was very fortunate on that end it was still a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot of online work i was fortunate on that end and i don't know that i could speak to like what a completely asynchronous or even synchronous experience was like um i only had one class that was fully online and it was synchronous so like we never even really did asynchronous work so i can't really speak too much about the online work even though i did have a lot probably a lot more than I would have if we were in a pandemic, right? Okay. College, I feel like, first semester of college, I always hear so many different experiences. Um, I watched a lot of, like, college videos like this before I, I went to school, and even when I was at school, because I'm on Christmas break right now, obviously, my pillow says la 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 la. Um, like, I watched a lot of videos, and I just kept, like, hearing different things about, you know, first semester of college i listened to the um gen z girl podcast a lot because she talks a lot about like her first semester of college and her experiences and it was kind of nice to hear those things but also at the same time i was like even though people have similar experiences no one's gonna have the same experience of being a freshman in college during a pandemic like it's not like i could go back like five years and find someone who's had the same experience you know kind of all in the same boat where we were like is this how it's supposed to feel kind of thing right and I did make new friends. I did meet people. I ha I was in a Bible study um, that I met some people at. And I obviously talked to people in my classes and stuff. But I feel like if a pandemic wasn't happening, I probably would have met way more people. And I've talked to a lot of my friends about that. And they're like, oh my god. Like, if we didn't have a pandemic, I would have been thriving. 
Like I would have met so many people, done so many things, and I was like, yes. It's not even that like my first semester was bad. Like I enjoyed my classes, I worked hard, I got all A's this semester, super proud of myself, um, which I'm happy about because I wanted this semester to kind of be a cushion for more semesters, especially with like the circumstances. If it was normal, I probably would have been thriving. You know, I probably would have like been on top of the world, and I think that's kind of how we all expected to be because we didn't know that this was gonna be going on this long, right? Like, I didn't think that the class of 2021 was gonna be going through this stuff their senior year, and it's awful. The stress of being in college is already, like, the worst thing ever. Like, being in college is so fun, but it's also, like, so much stress all the time. Like, you cannot get away from it because you're literally there all the time. And you have that stress, and then you put the stress of a pandemic and, like, worrying about your health. Your roommate's health is in the hands of you and, like, your family and your friends, and all of that piled on top of each other is just, like, an insane amount of stuff to handle. You could just tell that college students were really going through it. And college students are always kind of going through it, but, like, this semester especially. I hope this is making sense. I'm kind of just talking, you know, because it's, like, a little chit-chat kind of thing. Um... But yeah, I also cannot believe that my first semester of college is over. Like, I don't, I don't feel like this semester of college was wasted, but like, in a sense, I'm still kind of waiting for my college experience to happen, and I and it's already happened. You know what I mean? Like, I've already been in school for a semester, and I'm already on my first winter break, but like, I still feel like I'm waiting it. And it's kind of sad, because I know next semester is going to be like that too. Hopefully fall isn't, because if fall isn't... But yeah, this pandemic has just... It's been absolutely crazy, and I would say that, that, I mean, like, my first semester of college compared to a lot of other colleges was was pretty good, and I had a great time, and I missed school, obviously. I'm happy to be home, though. I'm happy to, like, be with my family, but um, it was just hard, and it was kind of like, like, I had just had FOMO the whole time. Like, <laughs> I'm like, this is a freaking pandemic, and I'm sitting here, and no one should be doing anything, and people are. And I, I am being a respectful person and trying to not get people sick. So um, I think a lot of people were really struggling with that and going through that. Um, obviously, in March, I think this was pretty earth shattering for a lot of people. Like, I just remember when this, like, first all happened, which feels like five years ago. Like, this literally feels like this year has been five and a half years long. But then I'm also like, wasn't it March, like, yesterday? Um... It's insane, but like I remember when this first all happened and I was like this can't this can't be real like this won't last longer than two weeks like there's no There's just no fathomable way That like a pandemic is gonna take over the world and I just remember being like what is happening? And I just kind of went with it. I feel like that's kind of how we all were we kind of just like went with it For like three months and then I got to June and we were like It's still here <laughs> um Ah, it's crazy. It's craziness that, it, like, I genuinely thought that, like, oh, I was like, my first semester of college will be normal. Like, things will be back to normal. Christmas, we'll have it. Thanksgiving, we'll have it. I just wanted to, like, have a little chit-chat with you. I don't know if any of that made sense. I'm sure it made sense to you if you're a freshman in college because I'm sure you're feeling all of the same things, especially if... Um, I had friends that were like completely online and at home, so I know that they had different experiences than I did, obviously, and my experience is not the same as everyone's, and I'm very, very grateful that I did not get sick this semester, and everybody in my family was healthy, and I kept everybody healthy, and everybody kept me healthy, and it's great, great, great stuff, because this is scary. It's very scary. I'm praying and hoping that things will be back to normal soon, because... I want a normal college experience and I think like I'm yearning for it so much not because I'm just like paying for it but I feel like you know senior year and like the idea of senior year was so glamorized and it sucked losing that like losing that experience especially with when we live in a culture where it's constantly like we're constantly consuming it you know it started when we were what how was I like six when High School Musical 3 came out and like that was just the epitome of what I wanted it to be and then you just watch all the teen dramas and all of that stuff. So I think losing that really hurt. And then I was like, oh, but I'll get the college experience, you know. I'll get to have that experience from all of those movies that glamorize that. <sighs> I just hope it's all back to normal soon. I hope some of you guys can feel for me. And I know a lot of you will probably, probably have it way worse than I do. Um, and I'm doing fine. I'm doing good. My family's healthy. My friends are healthy. I hope... All of you guys are doing well, and I honestly don't know when this video is going to go up, so. <laughs> um, it's the day after my finals, 
so my semester's over, but you might be seeing this two weeks from now. You might never see this. Um, you might be seeing it tomorrow. I don't really know because Miss Taylor Swift had to ruin it for me, so. But I hope you guys enjoyed this chit chat style video. If you want more college videos, I already have some on my channel, but I will definitely be doing more because I'm in college. And when you're in college, you do college style videos. <laughs> um, so if you want more, please stay tuned. Obviously, I'm on break right now, but new year, you're going to be getting some college vids. Um, yes, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will definitely see you in the next video. Bye, guys.